set up. Um, I have a lamp on this side and my new lamp on this side and all of my Sims games are lined up right here and um, it looks kind of funny when you're facing it but um, I, I couldn't find anything else to get the camera high enough. So let me know if you like it. Um, I like the, I'm using my mom's camera because my camera kind of sucks and it's kind of blurry. As some of you guys can probably tell the difference between the two. But, um, yeah, so let me know how this works out for you guys if you like it. So this is going to be a book review on Crazy Beautiful by Lauren Boratz, Boratz Logstead, I think. And this book was great. I, um, gave it four out of five stars. And it is about a boy named Lucius Wolf. And Lucius, um, blew his arms off in an explosion. And... Um, he made, he, he like caused the explosion. It wasn't like he was mixing chemicals and stuff in his basement. And, um, the other girl is named Aurora Bell. And this book is a rendi rendition of Beauty and the Beast. It's based kind of like a new spin on it. And, um, it was really, really good. I really enjoyed it. I loved, um, seeing like the little hints like Aurora Bell, Beauty and the Beast, and she likes to read. And her mother died when she was little. Well, not little. Like, a couple months ago. So, I guess she's kind of little. But, um, yeah, it's kind of interesting to see how it plays in Wolf. His last name's Wolf, like, Beast. And so, um, I really enjoyed it. The, all the characters were good. They very, very much reminded me of Beauty and the Beast. The characters, um, this guy named Jessup, he's kind of like the guest on to me. Like, I can compare it to the movie. He's kind of like the cocky Gaston kind of guy. And um, this book is written into different verses. Like, this is Aurora's chapter, and it goes back and forth, which I really like. And the chapters are pretty short. Some of them, let's see if I can find one. Some of them are like this, like they're super duper short. And um, it was a fast, fast read. I read it, yes, I started it. Um, last night, but I didn't really get into it until today, and I read it in one day. It's, I think, 192 pages, I believe. Let's see. Yeah, 193, technically. But, um, two pages don't really count, because there's, like, one sentence. But, yeah, I definitely get this one if you have a chance. Um, it's a beautiful story. It's very well written. Just, um, I really, really enjoyed it. So... If you are looking for a very sweet love story, a very, um, oh, my heart just went out to Lucius. I felt so bad for him. Um, Aurora kind of annoyed me in some parts, but that's kind of common for me because I don't really relate to a lot of female characters in books. I don't know why. I just prefer male characters. Um, that's because I'm not really girly. I'm not a girl at all. I don't know why I'm a girl, <laughs> but, um, I'm very much, I have boy kind of thoughts and stuff, and so, um, I don't really get a girl's thinking a lot, I don't know why, and so, um, she kind of annoyed me sometimes, but this book has a really good twist at the end, I wasn't expecting it, so, um, definitely, definitely check this out if you have a chance, it's a great book, and I highly, highly recommend it, so, um, yeah, this was a review request from somebody on my, um, oh gosh, what's it called? Form Spring account, so um, I'll put the link in the sidebar if you guys want to check out my Form Spring. You guys can ask me questions. I try to answer them once a day, so if you have anything, um, that would probably be the place to go if you have a question for me. So I check that a lot more than I check my YouTube account. So yeah, so that's the review for this. Four out of five stars, beautifully written, excellently executed. Four out of five stars, bam, very good. So the next book I am currently reading and I love already is the um, the Absolutely True Diary, uh, True Diary of a Part-Time Indian, I think the name is. And it's so funny. I feel so bad for that boy. But um, yeah, and I also went to Family Video and I got to Mario Kart and Super Mario Brothers. And I'm going to play them because I am addicted to these two games. I probably rented them so much that I could, probably could have bought them new by now. But um... Yeah, I love, love, love those games. So it's a very chill uh, for Saturday, uh, Friday night for me. Um, I made this delicious 
apple dumpling kind of thing. And it's from Pioneer Woman. I don't know if any of you guys know who she is. But she has a website and she has like different recipes and stuff. Oh my god, it's so good. It tastes like a caramel apple wrapped in a donut. I'll add a picture at the end of this video. Oh my god, you guys, it's so good. So, um... If you want the recipe, definitely go to Pioneer Woman. I'll put the link in the sidebar to the apple dum dumpling page. Oh my god. So, so good. And it's so easy. You can make it in, like, seriously no time. And it's a great crowd pleaser. So, um, yeah, that's all I have to talk about today. Let me know how you like the setup. Um, the lighting is a lot better, I know, and it's better than my webcam. So, um, I might stop using the webcam for a while and try this out. So, yeah, I hope you guys are having an awesome Friday night, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.